What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Mia. If this is your first time clicking on my video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and go ahead and click that notification bell so you don't miss any of my uploads. And once you do that, go ahead and put in the comments hashtag Mia Mafia so I know that you're a part of the gang. But yes, in today's video, y'all, it's another Black-owned business, Wash & Go Wednesday. And today I did feature the brand curls dynasty and this is how my hair is looking from that if y'all want to know my reviews and things like that from the video then definitely keep on watching hey y'all anywho so we're gonna get on into this video if y'all wonder why my boobs are sitting up so high it's because i have on a waist trainer um this is what it looks like here Yes, y'all, I'm trying to get this body snatched for the rest of this summer. But if you are interested in this waist trainer, it is a company by one of my good friends. And she's young, she's 20 years old, got her thing going on. It's called Pretty Snatched right here. Um, let me know if you guys wanna see like a workout type video because I am gonna like start working out at home, not in the gym. I'm gonna just do like some little at-home workouts and I'm gonna be wearing this all day. But yes, I will leave all her information down below just in case y'all interested. She got like sizes from like extra small all the way up to um, six XL, I think. I don't know, like it, she got a lot of sizes, y'all. So yes, go check her out and let me know if you guys wanna, um, wanna see like a little workout, you know, routine type video um, from me because I'm trying to get rid of my stomach, it's fat. But anywho, so we're about to go ahead and get into this video. Definitely gonna be using Curls Dynasty in this video. I'm super excited to be trying this brand out. I've never tried this brand before. So it's gonna be a really, ooh. Yeah, I think I just broke the freaking top. Anywho, so I have three products that I'm gonna be using today. I'm gonna be using their Kayla Kari Smoothie Leave-In. It looks like this. Hopefully y'all can see that. That's that. And then I'm gonna be using their vanilla cream custard. And that looks like that. Ooh. But yes, and then I'm gonna be using their organic oil blend. So yes, these are the three products that I picked up. I'm gonna be leaving them down in the description box. You already know the drill, just in case you are interested in buying but yes so let me go ahead and take this scarf off my not scarves take this towel off my head and we about to get into it i'm gonna do a side part today y'all because i've been doing i've been doing middle parts for like a long time so i'm like let me go back to the side and see you know if she's gonna give like some good vibes today all right y'all already know the drill i do already have some leave-in in my hair and go without and I have my My L organic sleeve in. I have this in there. So I'm really excited to try these products out. I've never really seen nobody using this brand like that. And they definitely are. Black phones, black phone. Yeah, yeah. Y'all can't sing, so don't miss me. <laughs> So I'm about to go in with the leave-in smoothie. Let's see how this is. Ooh. Mmm, it smells like really like, what is that smell? It's some type of like, I don't know, like a fruit smell. I don't, I don't know y'all, it just smells really good and fruity like. Yes, yeah, smells so good. Okay, it feels good. Definitely feels moisturizing. I mean, add a little bit more. But, ooh, this smells so good, y'all. Like, this is gonna have your hair smelling so freaking good. All right. It smells like a cake. Mmm, smells so good. Okay, now I'm going in with the vanilla cream custard. That smells so freaking good. Y'all, this waist trainer, when I tell y'all, it gets me together. <laughs> when I tell y'all, I tried to lay down with this thing on yesterday. Like, be lazy, like, I'm having a wig, but I'm gonna, like, lay down. I 
was so uncomfortable. I was like, mm -mm. she do got like different kinds on there where you can lay down, like can go to sleep in. This is not one that's recommended. But anywho, so this is what it looks like in the inside. And it's definitely pretty, it kind of reminds me of the, oh shoot, <laughs> I almost dropped it. It kind of reminds me of the, um, what is that? Talia Wajid Curly Cream, but it's a, it's not as like textured. Don't know if that makes sense. <laughs> but this smells good too. This smell isn't as strong as this one, but it does still smell good. So let me go in about this much. I should have sprayed more water on my hair, but I'm sorry. Dang, I forgot to brush out my hair. Like y'all, I'm tripping. I'm tripping. Okay, this is giving me some definition. It got two goods. These are the only products I'm using. All right, I'm gonna spray some more water. Try to brush it out and then add some more product. About to go on with some more. Cause look, every time I brush my hair out with the demon brush, it separates my hair more than clumping it together. But I like my hair to be nice and detangled. And I do the washing goes. Okay, y'all, this isn't giving me too much definition. <laughs> ah, oh no. And it's kind of white. Y'all can see. Oh Lord, I might have to throw a gel with this, y'all. You know, I really don't want to, but I, I don't, you know, I don't want my hair not to last. I don't know why, it seems like I don't want my hair to be flaky and I can see the products kind of like balling up a little bit. Y'all see that? <laughs> I had high hopes. I had high hopes. Let's see if more water will help it. Get it soaking wet, see if that helps. But it's not getting me there, y'all. This it seems like I need a gel with it. Mm -mm. No, it's not working out, you guys. And I got somewhere to go after this. I'm gonna have to throw some gel on here, y'all, because this is gonna be a frizzy mess. I can I can tell already. Hold on. It's like I feel like I'm cheating. But I need my hair turn. I got somewhere to go after this. I'm actually gonna be in a video shoot, period. So I got to be cute. But I'ma just throw some of this on there. Hopefully, y'all, I really hope my hair is not a frizzy, flaky mess. But I'ma throw some of this on here. It's not black on. It's not, I'm sorry. So sorry, but this is just not doing it. And I need something else to really hold my hair. And then it's like, with just those two products, I feel like it's gonna flake up. I'm like, what's going on? Now y'all see what this gel just did? Maybe, I don't know. I need to look on their website to see if they got a gel, cause I don't know why I didn't buy gel. I bought these like when I first knew I was gonna do the series. Now I got so much product on this section. But that looks 10 times better. This is an honest review, y'all. Just cause they're black on don't mean I'ma be biased. But you know. But yeah, y'all, I'ma just speed through this. I ain't nothing too deep. I don't really got nothing to talk about. And I'm just gonna be putting the leave-in smoothie and then the curling custard and adding a little bit of gel. Don't pay attention to the gel because it's not a part of the video. I just, my hair has to look like something because I'm going somewhere. Well, going to a video, a video shoot after this. Can't be looking cat raggedy. But anyhow, yeah, I'm just gonna speed this up. <laughs>
y'all, so I finished putting all the product in my hair. Now I'm gonna go ahead and lay my edges down. Let me know if there's any like black owned hair companies with some bomb edge control because this is the only one that works for my hair. All the other ones I done tried, they don't work. So I have to keep using this one because I don't have a choice. If not, it just will not be laid. But as far as the products, it's definitely like balling up, but hopefully it doesn't look too flaky. Cause don't you just hate when you do your hair and then it's flaky? It's like, it's like it's dirty. And you just did it. We still cute though. But let's see how this is going to look. I am gonna diffuse my hair. If you wanna see an in-depth video on how I diffuse my hair, go ahead and click the card up here. I will leave it up here or in the description box for y'all. Yeah, I'm gonna do that and I'll be back to show y'all the results. Stay tuned. So my hair is done diffusing. It's pretty much dry. It's a, it's a tad bit still damp, but I'm finna go outside. So I know it's gonna like really dry super quick. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and put some, the oil in there. And this is what it's looking like. I showed y'all in the beginning of the video. It seems like a very lightweight oil, but yeah, this is nice. My hair actually turned out pretty good. I don't really see any um, flaking which I was surprised because I'm like, that, uh, what is it? That custard really didn't mix well with that leave-in. So I'm just like, I don't know, it's a flake, but my hair feels pretty soft and it's not crunchy at all. But yeah, okay, I might've been sleeping on them before. Maybe she just needs to get paired with a good gel and you know she will come through for the girls because my hair looks good it looks nice and soft it's definitely defined there's no like flaking or none of that it looks really good all right i think i'll put some bobby pins on the side well let me pick it out just just a little bit before i do that so it can be a little fluffy, just a tad. Okay, I'm gonna put some bobby pins on the side, just cause I did this when my hair was like straight down the middle, and it was pretty cute. So let's see how it looks like this. I need to get some like decorative ones, like you know, some that say something. Or some gold ones. I feel like that would be cute. Okay, we're cute. What y'all think? Let me know down in the comments. Let your girl know. What's T? She cute or no? Nah? Okay, y'all. So here is the final look of this hair. It turned out pretty cute. Even though I did have to add the gel. I do recommend pairing this curly cream. Well, this uh, vanilla cream custard with some type of gel because this doesn't have a strong hold on, on its own if you are gonna be doing a wash and go. But I feel like it'll work good for like twist outs and stuff. And it didn't leave my hair flaky even though it didn't really mix too well with the leave-in. But I mean, I guess it did because it didn't leave my hair flaky. But So that's a good thing. Um, as far as the leave-in smoothie, I really like this. I feel like it was very, very moisturizing. It smells so good, y'all. I feel like I had a lemon cake on my head or something. I don't know. It just smells so freaking good. But 
But yeah, so I really like that. I feel like this is a nice oil blend as well as very lightweight. It's not gonna weigh down your hair. And it's definitely gonna give you, you know, that extra shine. Uh, I don't know if this is used for like, let's see. Yeah, you can use it for like hot oil treatment, sealing moisture, oil rinsing, scalp massages, and things like that. So it's definitely a nice, good mix of an oil blend. But yeah, that's pretty much it for those products. Um, yeah, I really like how my hair turned out. I feel like it's very cute. I feel like it is gonna last me. Um, compared to like the wash and go I did in the last video, I feel like it was already too, too poofy on, on day one. But I feel like this definitely will last me like a good minute because it's like super defined, it's soft, and it's not like too poofy or stretched out, you know? But yeah, I really like how this looks. But yeah, that's pretty much it for this. Oh, I just spit. <laughs> That's pretty much it for this Wash and Go Wednesday. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if y'all did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget, to scrub, don't forget to subscribe if you're new and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. And once you do that, go ahead and put in the comments, hashtag me and Mafia, so I know that you are part of the gang. Yeah, but um, let me know down in the comments which black owned business you would got you guys would like me to review next and yeah i'll see you guys in my next one bye